A cool update to a story we brought to you last week. A local artist tribute to health care workers is now on the move. Jenna Rice is the artist behind this mural in High Point. Now, the design was then used on a T-shirt, but now the project is larger than life. It's turning into a mobile thank you card. The idea originally just came from, you know, kind of just wanting to paint something. Jenna Rice never expected her art to get the praise it has. One of my friends called me and she's like, hey, do you want to go to the pit, go to High Point um, to go paint? That was in early April and this was the finished project, a mural dedicated to healthcare workers. I want them to know that we care and that we're rooting for them and they're all our heroes in this uh, battle we're fighting against the coronavirus. Her mural caught the eye of Maury Kennedy's team who was raising money to feed health care workers at Cone Health in Greensboro. Rice's mural was then used on the backs of t-shirts given to those who donated to the Feed the Frontline campaign. We're all in this together and uh, we want our health care workers to know that. Rice then agreed to recreate the mural on a panel that would travel to different hospitals. But Greensboro developer Marty Cotis, who planned to sponsor the project, had another idea. You know, he said, I have this really large box truck. You could paint on that and then park that in front of the hospital and then maybe be able to park it in front of other hospitals as well. So with spray can in hand, she went to work. She finished the display on the 24 by 7 feet truck in just three days with some slight changes from the original. I kind of wanted to challenge myself and I thought that it would be really cool if I might be able to pull off a photo realism piece instead. Those who donated to the Feed the Frontline campaign will then have their names written on the back of the truck. The truck will serve as a mobile thank you card since it will be used to transport the donated meals. And we want them to feel appreciated and, and loved for, for what they're doing for us. Then on the other side of the truck, you will see this, another mural painted by local artist Raman Bardwash, superheroes fighting a virus. He says that's exactly what our real life heroes are doing. The whole world is looking up to them for, for saving the world. And, and when they are going through dark times, I think this is going to you know, really brighten their day. So that truck will be unveiled tomorrow at noon at Burger Warfare. That is where the meals are going to be from uh, for the health care workers. Uh, Jenna says that she plans to paint an inspirational message on the top of the truck so that it, when it is parked at a hospital, those on a higher floor will be able to see that message as well.